She's for ages six and older, and Alice is a cute little baby owl that you teach to fly. You can also play games and interact with her in various ways. First thing, when you get Alice, you'll want to charge her up. There's a USB cable attached to her nest. You can plug it into your computer, or I've been using a USB wall adapter that also works quite well. When charging, her eyes will flash red. When she's fully charged, they turn to a solid green. Now, there are different ways to interact with Ali's. She has a sensor here on her head, one under the beak, and one on her chest. And when she's on her nest, you can use the one on the chest to tickle her or play games. There's a button right here on the back to do that. When she's out of the nest, the chest sensor does not work. Now, I'm going to go ahead and turn her on and demonstrate. There's your on off switch right here, and there's the button to play games with her. Let's go ahead and get her on. There she is. Ah. Oh, don't be sad. There. She's getting happier now. I'm going to go ahead and put her back on the nest and demonstrate tickling. She thinks that's hilarious. Let's go ahead and put her on the nest. That will tickle her. Oh, and she's a little gassy there. We'll go ahead and do our forehead sensor. Ah. Oh, she's hungry. Let's go ahead and feed her. Uh -oh. That's okay, little owl. It happens to everyone. Let's go ahead and play a little game with her. We'll push the button on the back. This is a color game. So, you'll watch her eye color, and the color you see is the one you'll tap when she starts to play. Oops. Oh, I can do it. And green. you do teach her to fly, if you want to start all over, you can simply hold the button down for 10 seconds and that will reset her and you can teach her to fly all over again. But now let's see if we have any luck getting our little owl airborne. Right. Up and down. <laughs> 